This is Mark Eibner with Broker IPTV, and we're up at the Summit Association of Realtors and the Summit Chamber of Commerce, looking at some local issues here in Summit County. And specifically, I'm fortunate enough today to have one of the members running for the Silverthorne Town Council, Anne Marie Sandquist. And Anne Marie, I was wondering if you could maybe talk briefly about maybe one or two critical issues facing the Silverthorne community up here. We have several issues. Um, Silverthorne does not have a property tax, and we're so we're de largely dependent on sales tax in our town for revenue and to keep our county or our town services going. Um, so what we're looking to do is try to enhance our our tax base, and we want to encourage business and growth in our town. Silverthorne doesn't have a downtown area um, at this point, and you know we'd like to see a downtown core developed. And I've served on the Silverthorne Planning Commission for over a year now. We've been working on a new comprehensive plan for the town, and that would include a town core that has a pedestrian area, um, sidewalks. We would have on-street parking. We'd be looking at mixed use, where you'd have retail on the bottom and then residential on the on the top, and you know be able to increase the density a little bit in that area to to create. Um, uh, some growth potential. Well, Silverthorne is, is sort of a long and narrow town because we've got both the highway, Highway 9 that runs through the town and then we also have the river that runs through the town and the river is actually a great asset to Silverthorne and one that we aren't using fully right now and that's part, so the kind of our town plan would start in a sense with the river. We want the river to be accessible to all of our um, residents and be able to use it you know so if they want to come down in the morning and have a cup of coffee and sit by the river um, that that's you know that that's accessible for them and right now we see a lot of our residents leaving Silverthorne and going to other towns to use those type of amenities so for us it starts with the river and then um, across the highway um, is where we'd be looking to kind of center the town um, possibly increase the height requirements or the height uh, the building heights in that in that area so that um, you know the builders could come in and make it a profitable for them to to want to build great thank you Anne-Marie it's been a pleasure Thanks, Mark. find more real estate videos at brokeriptv.com